besties it's your girl kelly and Irie, and we are back with another video as you can tell by the caption and thumbnail today we are going to be doing some hygiene shopping at target i cannot wait to go in here to go see what they got i'm ready to find out if they got some new things up in here um if you are an aspiring youtuber and you want to see how to go ahead and get into this money bag go ahead and look at the description box baby because i got a youtube ebook for you that will definitely help you get to the bag okay anyways um if you are a new viewer thank you so much for tuning in i really appreciate and love you so much um you're gonna love it here this is a part of my girl talk series where we talk everything girly and yeah let's go ahead and get into it place today and because i just walked in and i seen that they do have these it's a ten dollar claw and scrunchy set together y'all know y'all been on these bad not me but y'all but it's ten dollars but they do have like a whole little scrunchy thing here for like ten dollars it's a whole set um they have a couple other sets like orange so cute let me bring my basket over here y'all so i can get out the way like, look at these. So cute. Let me turn it back this way. This basket kind of hard. Okay, so anyways. Y'all know um, South Tire is really, really good. But they actually have some travel sets right here. So, um, like how they have over there at that beauty bar. They have like the smaller one with um, niacinamide in there um this one has niacinamide this one doesn't the pink one but the pink one actually smells better out of all of them i don't know i just feel like that but this is ten dollars too and then they also have this avatara set <laughs> i'm dropping stuff help me jesus but they also have this Help me, help me. This avatar is that, and I really like their masks actually because they're paraben, silicone, fragrance, and cruelty free. And they have a few different ones in there. One of my faves actually is this juicy watermelon one. Um, but they have the uh, juicy avo bravo, juicy peach beach, um, pineapple, watermelon and the hydrated one redo and you see that has vitamin c in there really really good then they have some other cute stuff like this workshop oh so cute and i love the packaging right now like they killing it and these are the um face masks that i was telling y'all about a few different times they have a mud mask that's really good for oily skin they have a pill off one with a watermelon they have an aloe vera and witch hazel one that's a really nice tony one they have a whole bunch of stuff down here y'all they even got like these bath scissors that are like ten dollars like look they got all this stuff so cute oh and then <laughs> the one that i forgot to tell y'all about is they got this natrium natrium glow getter multi-oil body wash which is super hydrating and they have the body lotion together for ten dollars they got these new lip glosses cover girl look like how freaking cute there's a um clean fresh this one is called sugar poppy this one is called peach out you're just jelly glamingo pink <laughs> But first, Cosmo, like this is so freaking cute, and it's $8.99. They have some other ones up here. These are um, scented. These have like a glassy, like shine to them. And then this one has like nude colors. So I, I thought this would be colored, but it's not, even though it looks like it. It just has like a nice shine to it. But this one is colored. So I kind of, I wish they had testers. But they don't. And I don't want to be over here putting my nose on nobody. Because lip lip gloss is like real. It's different. It's real different. Buy three, get one free. I think I showed y'all this. Like last. Was it like this last week? I think it was. But anyways. 
So I just gotta show y'all. This right here is literally my favorite cleanser when it comes to dealing with like acne. So this one has niacinamide, hyaluronic acid, and vitamin C. It just closes those pores and get rid of those dark spots after you get done battling with acne. But this one is $4.99. Super affordable for that. It's Rayal. I really, really love Rayal. Um, theirs is supposed to be over here at $6.99. I don't know who put this over here, but somebody did. It wasn't me. Anyways, there's three in here and it's good for up to eight hours you can use this during school during work whatever you can put it on the front and the back if y'all can see it this is literally my fave right here but yeah 6.99 and then also this bio oil right here is really that one like this one is 6.49 for this size the regular size is damn near 20 dollars okay but i really really like this to clear up any dark spots and things like that on your skin it has helped me out tremendously that's what my skin look like how i do they never have like the super serum no more used to, they used to have the super serum up here but they only have the vitamin c serum the true skin one but this is still good because it has vitamin c vitamin e and hyaluronic acid in there so it's still good still good serum. see if i need to re-up in this area of skincare real quick give me a second bobby but i really really love this like this really was a game changer for me i think i'll tell y'all this every single time now like every single time but this is really a game changer for me like this hydrating for me oil y'all know i got dry skin if you don't know and you new here i do have dry skin so i love using things that are super super hydrating to me i don't have to worry about it because i don't have oily skin but this has squalene oil and hyaluronic acid and ceramides in there i've been calling it ceramides for so long i want to smack myself because what why would ceramides be in there it's ceramides i need to i just I just want to apologize every single time that I've ever said that. <laughs> I'm saying that's for everybody that's watching, okay? Anyways, y'all, so the smaller size, which is the 16, no, it's a 12 ounce. The 12 ounce one is 13, 13 $13.69, and then the 16 ounce right there is $15.49, and then the, yeah, so anyways um that's my favorite cleanser right now as far as like to hydrate my skin i'm not dealing with like any acne or anything right now but if i was i would use a cleanser that has salicylic acid in here like this one and um this one is really good because it has salicylic acid in there um and it's non-drying non-irritating it exfoliates your skin while softening and smoothing your skin out so that one's not super super crazy or like trying to dry my skin out because a lot of times when like there's a product that helps with acne they try to like dry the skin out with the cleanser and it's like i don't want my skin to be dry but i just wanted to work on those um those little pimples when i'm cleansing my face so but if you are dealing with acne and you are dealing with oiliness, I would highly, highly recommend using a cleanser that has um, probably salicylic acid and niacinamide in there. Now, niacinamide is really, really good for um, stopping excess oil production. Niacinamide is good for that and also like clay. So let me, let me just, let me show you, let me show you. So this is what I'm talking about. CeraVe actually has what they call an acne control cleanser. It has 2% salicylic acid in there, which is a really good acne treatment that combats all the acne. But then you have the niacinamide in there and clay combating the extra oils in your skin at the same time. And so I really, really love this for that. I just wanted to show y'all and tell y'all about that. Um, they also has a benzoyl peroxide acne treatment um that has hyaluronic acid and niacinamide in there so if you think about this think about like salicylic acid like a little bit stronger because obviously it is 10 percent in there so it's stronger they do have one that's four percent so it's just like depending on your um depending on if it's like really bad or if it's like you're able to control it like if it's six if it's cystic i would say try benzoyl peroxide 4% if you feel like you're okay after 4% then go on to 10% I just wouldn't jump right into 10% right out of bed because you just don't know how your skin is going to react to certain things but yes 
CeraVe is a really, a really, really good and affordable skincare line that will get your skin together. But on the flip side, when I'm talking about acne and dealing with like pimples and stuff, um, this right here, this is sticker. This one right here, when I tell y'all, this one is $16. I swear they go on, um, I swear they go on sale like once every two weeks, to be honest. But that right there really does do what it needs to do. It's um, clear, so it's more so of like, you're not really going to be able to tell that you got it on. Especially if you, um, if you don't want it to look like you got anything on your face. Like, I know a lot of kids nowadays, like, they would like to use Starface because Starface actually has, like, stars. So it looks, like, more decorative versus having a patch on your face and it just looks blah. You know what I'm saying? But... I really feel like the the this stick of the killer that I just showed you is a really really good product because it has micro darts in there, meaning micro. They don't write. They don't like to use the word micro needles because that kind of scare people away. So saying micro dart is a little bit easier, but the micro darts actually penetrate your skin and it has salicylic acid. So again, I was telling you that's an acne treatment. Well, good acne treatment. So the salicylic acid goes into the your skin that's really, really good. And it penetrates your skin instead of it being on, like, the surface of your skin. And then the swabs actually have salicylic acid in them as well. So you use the swab first and then you put on the patch. You can keep the patch on. They're saying for a minimum of two hours. But my boyfriend had this on for, like, five hours. And he literally came back home and it was gone. Like, wasn't nothing there. And he has cystic acne. So, yeah. I feel like it is a little bit more, but honestly, it does what it needs to do the same day versus like having to continue to use different patches. And with it having the micro darts in there, it penetrates your skin a lot better than it just being on the surface level, honestly. Especially if you're dealing with cystic acne, girl. This is if you need to use like a more hydrating cream like this moisturizing cream is really really good for your face it's good for your body too honestly but this has hyaluronic acid in there and the cream is super super hydrating for me because i do have dry skin i like to use more of a cream than a lotion if you get what i'm saying but and it's not heavy either and you can use this too but they have different prices so this one is $13.59 and then this one is like $15.49 but if you're cool with just like a regular regular like lotion this is cool too it's very lightweight it's only like $13.69 but yeah um I don't know I'll be talking to y'all about toners too but y'all already know I love Thayer's toners like regardless <laughs> regardless of anything else but um I feel like I need to go over, I haven't talked to y'all about exfoliating a lot because I just, I feel like the scents that I've been getting are like pretty neutral or normal, but I don't feel like I've been talking to the girls about exfoliation, like how I used to talk to y'all about exfoliation. And you know me, like you know that. I don't like the idea of having to buy this Dr. Bronner soap here because I know that they got it cheaper at TJ Maxx, but when I can catch it at TJ Maxx, like, I can't catch it at TJ Maxx all the time. That's the thing that's killing me. And I love this. I love this soap. <laughs> like, this, I use this for my back door area. Y'all might think I'm crazy. I don't care, okay? I don't care. I use this for my back area or as um, a base wash depending on what I have available. A lot of times I like to use the antibacterial soap for a base wash. But if I only got this, then this is what I'm using. I'm really going to get the big bottle. I was thinking about getting the 1129 but honestly, I got too many people at my crib. And this is really good. I did try this um, Baby Unscented Bar Soap. This one. And it was really good. So I would say this one. It's my favorite one as well because it actually smells good. So this is a Tropical Glow Firming Body Scrub. It smells really, really good. And the texture is amazing. I feel like they nailed this. I feel like they nailed it. They nailed it in, in the texture. They nailed it in the moisture. They just nailed it all together. Um, I really want to take a picture real quick. Because 
Okay. Okay. I just need to take one for my thumbnail, y'all. Okay, boom. So that's that. And then the second one that I really, really like is the papaya paradise one. This smells so freaking good. And the texture is amazing. So when you exfoliate your skin, you're really getting rid of like a dead skin cell layer pretty much to um, expose a smoother layer of your skin. Right after you exfoliate, girl, you need to go ahead and lock in that moisture to make sure that you extend the smooth skin like, if you know what I'm saying. Like you want it to be smooth for as long as possible. Okay. So when we're exfoliating, that's exactly what we're doing. We can exfoliate physically, so with sugar scrubs, with a dry brushing, you can exfoliate that way. And then I'll show y'all that in a minute. Or you can chemically exfoliate by using AHAs or BHAs. And those work really, really good too. Um, but yeah. Um, this vitamin C one, even though it doesn't really smell like anything, it actually has my skin go low and every time I use it. And it smells so good. It just doesn't give like, it doesn't have like a scent, like a fruity, fruity smell. But that's, that's my baby. And the other one is the Coco Lotta. This one. Oh my god, it smells so freaking good. And they just give, like, the whole aesthetic of this Coco Lotta is given. Because the little specks in here actually don't exfoliate your skin, I don't think. I don't, I don't even know. I don't know. Because they kind of look like poppy seeds, but it doesn't say that it's poppy seeds on there, so. But... Is the next thing this they actually just came out with this moonlight glow i was kind of skeptical at first when i first smelled it because i'm like do i really like this scent but i do it smells good it paired really really good with the gucci flora the perfume i'll be pairing these boys up this one is a lotion or not the lotion but the body butter and the gucci flora ship kit um I think those are my only fans, honestly. I did really like the, um, I don't really like, like, super, super sweet scents like this, unless it's given, like, a bakery. I don't know why. But, um, this strawberry scent, it actually smells good. So, and it's so cute. But yeah, almost like scents like this, like cotton candy. I don't know why, but I just feel like it's super sweet and I don't like it. Like, it smells like baby dolls or it's just not giving grown. But yeah, so when I was talking about dry brushing, I was talking about stuff like this. So you can actually use this. It's a dry brush and I really, really love to incorporate this in my skin, in my routine sometimes. Not every single day, but this is like a really like good exfoliation before you actually get in the shower. So go ahead and get those layer, that layer off. This one is $5.99. And then they actually have some, um exfoliation gloves i know i feel like these are like moderate pretty much i mean it doesn't really give exfoliation that much um but it does it does a little bit of something it's, it's more abrasive than i would say like a towel or a rag you know what i'm saying but it's just not it's not like how it would be with these loofahs now the loofahs i feel like are top tier exfoliators so yeah but loofahs are like 2 dollars here and I like how big they are they're really really good actually so but yeah I just wanted to show y'all that oh my god so girl I tried out this um this bath cloth this shit hurt okay I was using it on my back because one of, one of the girls said something about this and I tried it and I was like oh y'all try it I'm about to try it I tried it <clears throat> that shit was still sitting where it was sitting you heard me I'm like, that is not, not good. It hurts. Okay, friends. So my camera actually did end up dying. And that's so annoying because <laughs> I was just in my car charging it. And it was like all the way at the top, like all the way at the top. And for some reason, it just, it just went dead. But anyways, I don't need to buy this, but I'm just telling you, friend. Like this 24-hour body lotion, the vanilla cashmere set is so freaking good by EOS. Okay, so boom. I wasn't even messing with EOS lotions at first. I'm going to tell you the truth because 
I just walked past it. But when one of my subscribers was like, oh my God, like I use EOS lotions all the time. They're really, really good. I said, oh, okay, sis, let's try it. So I did try this one. I, well, I was over here smelling it, of course. But this was the favorite, like my favorite scent out of all of these. And so I purchased it and I've been hooked ever since, like bottles. I can't even tell you how many bottles since she told me that. But yeah. So anywho, um, I'm going to get over here to the oils and stuff. So I like using this oil after I get out of the shower to lock in some good moisture. This one is $11.59, and I like how that smells. Both of them smell really good, but I find that I use this one a lot more. So, yeah. And um, another thing I'm going to tell y'all about real quick before I leave over here, because I really want to get to the body wash, but this weightless wet skin moisturizer, when I tell y'all, I was shook. <laughs> was shook i still put on lotion because i wanted to to hydrate my skin a little bit more just not even hydrate i just wanted the scent okay but anyways this right here smells really really good and is so freaking hydrating first of all it has hyaluronic acid in here it has shea butter oil in there like it's just so hydrating so let me tell you what to do girl you might think that this is crazy or weird because i felt weird when i was doing it i'm like i just washed myself like why would i put this on but boom you apply this while you're in the shower, but before you dry off. So apply it to wet skin, get out the shower, dry off, and your skin is gonna be so freaking hydrated. The whole And it smells good. Like without lotion, it smells good. But I'll be pairing this with lotion. Like this right here, I just recently started pairing it with this, the coconut rice milk shea butter one. That's $8.99. That smells really, really good. And I'm gonna show you what body wash I pair this with too to get a nice scent. But this one is $9.79. Yeah, let me show you. I really just want to pass out. Because that was my last, like, that was the last thing I wanted to do. Was to use my camera. Like, to use my phone camera at that. She just pissed me off. But I gotta do it. In the body wash section, and I really, really love this... Body Love Moisture Boost. I tell y'all about this all the time, but this has hyaluronic acid in there. So it locks in the moisture. It brings some moisture to the top of your skin, first of all. And then it locks it in. So it's really, really good. And then this right here, the Crush Macadamia and Rice Milk, smells so freaking good. Buy one and get one 50% off right now. Oh my God. This is the um, Crush Macadamia and Rice Milk. This one smells so good. And then this one is the pomegranate seeds in shea butter. So I actually love both of these. They have another scent. I think it was like a mango one. But for some reason, they don't have it here. And also, we have this um, antibacterial care. This is what I was telling you about that I use as a base wash. The antibacterial um, soap or body wash. It's really, really good. Um... It does have the 0.13% antibacterial in there. It is $6.99, which is really, really good. It smells good. Um, <laughs> another antibacterial soap is something, this is something that people use a lot. And this one has 0.10%. So actually, the um, antibacterial care over there with the body wash has a lot more antibacterial than this soap. I really don't like that soap, though, because that stink. Like, I just, I just don't. I could never get jiggy with it like never i just bought some um raw sugar scrubs from uh, tj maxx y'all and it was like seven dollars like here it's like fourteen dollars and 69 cents look for real i bought this and the yellow kind those are really bomb though like quality for real for real but anyways um this right here is what i was telling y'all that y'all needs to pair with um the wet Wait, weightless whatever that was <laughs> the oils that i was telling y'all about yeah the one you put on in the shower you should pair this body wash with that it's super super good and it's like six dollars and 99 cents that's my fave this is my favorite relaxing body wash ever this is good for sensitive skin and it does not stink a lot of sensitive skin and hyperallergenic stuff stink and dove do not even dove really that one like i if you're sleeping on Dove, I don't know why. Like, you really sleep on yourself, for real, for real. But this Shea Butter and Vanilla scent is so freaking good. Like, it smells so good. This one is, like, $10, but it lasts for so long. But I end up getting, like, big ones like this because, of, like, it's for people in my house. And, yeah. 
they love this scent too. I think I'm going to end up buying this size versus buying the little size because they, they love this one too. So yeah, so they got Native Body Wash and deodorant on sale. Um, I didn't even talk to y'all about Native Body Wash, <laughs> but Native Body Wash has um, sugar cookie, which is really my favorite scent. I'm going to show y'all real quick. This is probably my fave scent from them. The sugar cookie one is at $8.99. The coconut and vanilla smells good. And the honey saguaro is definitely that one. You do have like this Dove deodorant. I really, really do love Dove. But this 0% really took it to another level. Like when I first transferred or stopped using aluminum deodorant, I started using Dove 0%. And when I first started, never had a problem. I love this coconut and pink jasmine one though. This one is $6.99. Um, I recently just tried the cucumber and tea scent. That one is good. And then they actually have a sensitive one. If you are sensitive, like under in that area, then there's, I feel like you should start out with this one. If you don't know like how you feel about other scents, but yeah. I really, really love them. Never had an issue. Never darkened my armpits. Never like had me funky outside. Cause I've been wearing zero percent all summer, and it's November, and I've been doing this for uh, probably like a year or two now. I think. Okay, y'all. So I feel like we should start over here on this side. Okay. <laughs> like we should start over here on this side because i always end up starting over there with the um let me get a closer look i always start over there with the feminine wash and stuff like that so the brand that i really really love right now and i've been loving is the l brand so they're 100 percent plant-based in the core and um there's a chlorine free top layer there's no synthetic pesticides, dyes, or fragrances. And honestly, like at this big age, y'all, <laughs> I didn't think I would be wearing pads. Like, honestly, I felt like I would still be more into tampons, but like they really like lengthen my period like no other. I don't even know. I don't even know what the, what the deal was. But if you are going to use a tampon, when I tell you that these have my stomach feeling so much better, what it normally would have been like for real for real but yeah anyways so um these are 11.79 i really love using these these are the extra long overnight ones these are really really good for nighttime honestly even though they're saying like they're maxi pads and this and that you actually have this one over here which is the ultra thin pads where it's not going to be like too thick and you're not worried about like it, you know, me and seeing throughout the day, but you still need the coverage. That's good. But this is really good for the nighttime. I'm really not lying to y'all. So, um, <clears throat> they're eleven seventy nine. Um, my regular, honestly, would be like the super. Um, <laughs> just because it has a lot more coverage than the regular one. Like the regular one is almost like the panty liners to me. So yeah, these are really good. This one is eleven seventy nine. Obviously, the smaller amount that you get, the cheaper it'll be. Like right here, this is thirty six in there for nine nineteen, but there's twenty maxi pads in here for seven sixty nine. Okay, but then you go right here, and then there's nine nineteen for forty two. So it really depends on which one you get. But honestly, love, love, love this brand. Okay, you already know I love new pad in the bottom of my heart this one is 9.89 like i told y'all at tj maxx it is a little bit cheaper at tj maxx than um target however i i don't always catch the sensitive one at tj maxx so i always end up having to come back here to get it <laughs> which is crazy but um and then i do love these i still got these at home so i don't need to get them but i'm gonna tell you about why i really love them so especially when you're on your period and things like this like it's really really easy for you to um cleanse that area and you know not having to deal with like tissue like sometimes tissue do just don't do what it needs to do when you dealing with what you're dealing with so this one is 5.99 
um for these and it's 15 towelettes in here and you can easily put these in your purse in your bag and whatever i really really love this everything else is like literally gone from over here that i wanted to tell y'all about <laughs> like the bork assets for bb and stuff but it's gone but i really love their products like all of their products has genuinely helped me for real um but i've never used this this anti-itch vulva cream but i can imagine that it does work but i haven't used that um but this vaginal care probiotic is really really good it's good for bacteria yeast your urinary tract all three of these is 30 capsules in here and it's supposed to be up here so it's 24 dollars 99 cents for all of that in there absolutely amazing okay so this one is for my thick girlies i keep forgetting to show y'all exactly what i be talking about when i'm talking about body light but this right here is the um for her anti-shave moisturizing balm this is really really good it's not oily or irritating to your skin or anything and this one is eight dollars and 99 cents i really really loved using this this entire summer this actually had me okay to walk around in shorts because i'm telling you right now before like i had to wear like biker shorts all the freaking time and i was able to wear a little bit shorter shorts and then also wear my dresses so yeah this is really good and it works really really well y'all i really feel like i need to be done y'all look at my skin i didn't even do my skincare routine and it looks like this like so cute i don't know it's a little bump coming right here y'all can see it but for the most part your girl is looking good still but anyways i really feel like i need to end up closing this video out because i talk to y'all about everything <laughs> that i need to talk to y'all about so yeah um oh those are oils so yeah girls i will go ahead and close the video out thanks so much for tuning in and i will see you in my next video bye